Hey, I'm Courtney Waterman, your tutor. Lover of anime, manga, and math. And you just tuned into another session of Tutor Me Senpai. Welcome back, everyone. Today we're jumping into a fourth grade topic, place value common names. Now, if you're new to my channel, I'll be putting time codes in for this video in the description box below. So use that to skip ahead to whatever part of the video you think is most interesting. As always, if you have any questions about what you see today, or even your own homework, you can always visit me on my Facebook page, at Tutumi Senpai, and tell me all about it there. Today's video is going to have two parts, so leave a like, smash subscribe, and let's get started. In my previous video, we talked about reading large numbers, and one thing that we talked about needing in order to do so was your comma name. So, we covered thousand and million in our previous video, but there are so many more common names. In today's video, we're going to be covering the four most common common names that you're going to run into outside of school. Now, once again, you may not need all of these for fourth grade, but you will run into these in your everyday life at one point or another. So your list is going to be as follows. The very first common that you find is going to be your thousand comma. Your second one is going to be your million comma. Your third one is going to be your billion comma. And then your fourth one is going to be your trillion comma. So we're stopping there, but there are many, many more. But these are going to be your first four commas that you're going to find in your number. And to quickly review what we talked about in our previous video, how are we going to name our commas? Well, if you remember, we talked about needing to start from which side, the left side or the right side when we're naming commas. Well, we're going to be starting from the right side. So remember, we're starting from the right side and we're traveling across our number. And every time we find a comma, we assign it a name. So once again, the very first comma you run into is your thousand comma. The next comma you run into is your million comma. And you may not run into any more. However, if you do, we're going to have a billion comma and a trillion comma. Try not to mix up the order. This is the order that you have to name your commas in. You can't play around with that. You can't switch it around. This is the specific order that you name your commas. So now that we have our comma list, let's play a quick game of name that comma to see if you remember what order these names show up in. At any time, if you need to rewind this to find your comma list again, no worries. However, I will remove this to see if you remember exactly the order. So make sure you look at it because it's going to be gone in just a second. Now we're going to name that comma. And I've given you a really big number here with the first four commas listed out. However, our names are not in the correct order. What you have to do for name that comma is figure out is it A, B, C, or D that I'm pointing to. I will be pointing to a comma and you tell me what letter has the correct name. Remember, when you're naming your commas, you start from the right. So let's jump into naming our first comma. What is going to be the name of this comma here? I'll give you a little bit of time to figure that out. What is the name of this comma here? Is it A, B, C, or D? If you said C, you would be correct. This is the billion comma. Billion. If you're going from the right, this is going to be your billion comma. Let's do our next one. What's going to be the name of this comma? Give you a little bit of time to figure that one as well. If you said D, thousand, you are correct. This is the very first comma you're going to run into, and it's the thousand comma. Good job. How about this comma right here? What's going to be the name of this comma? Is it going to be A, million, B, trillion, C, billion, or D, thousand? If you said B, trillion, that would be correct. This is your trillion comma. All right, one more. What is going to be the name of this comma right here? Is it A, million, B, trillion, C, billion, or D, thousand? If you said A, million, you would be correct. This is your million comma. So remember, you're always going to start from your right. You start from the right, and you name them in order, but you have to remember the order in which they show up. Thousand, million, billion, trillion. If you can nail that order and remember these names, reading a number this big is going to be much, much 
much easier. So I hope you're following today's game and I hope you see that as long as you remember your order, you can name any of your commas that you're gonna run into. However, if you have any questions about what you see today or even on homework, remember, you can visit me on my Facebook page at Tudumi Senpai and tell me all about it there. If you hadn't done so already, remember to leave that like. It really helps the channel by letting YouTube know that you found the video helpful. And if you found the video helpful, so can someone else. So leave a like, hit the notification bell, smash the subscribe button, and share this video with a friend. Well, that's all the time I have for today. I'm really hoping this helped with your homework and I'm looking forward to seeing you again next week. I'm Courtney, and this has been another session of Tutor Me Simpa.